Hey, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Infinite Regression, this magical place between dead and alive, dreaming and sleeping and awakening and frightening and night terrors and somnambulance. Anyway, regardless, <laughs> saying random words in a string, hoping they make any sense. It looks squarish in the middle. Didn't you see that this is squarish sort of nonsense? Anyway, we're just like, we've got so many freaking games to review. We're getting like uh, down toward the center of the wheel. It's getting awfully, uh, what are those things called? Oh, infinite geographic forms. You know what I'm talking about. Hold up. God dang it. Fractals, dingus. I was talking about fractals. Jeez. My God. <laughs> I swear, if my head weren't attached to itself, it would probably be attached to something else. Anyway, let's just spin the wheel and find out. Because I'm sure there are games. Games for playing, games for enjoying, games for having fun with. Let's see. Oh, oh boy. Victor Varan. I have no idea what this is, but we about to find out. Victor Varan will be with you in just a second. All right. Victor Varan. I, I don't know anything about it, but this fool fights vampires, though. If this fool does not fight vampires, we have all been lied to. All of us. Anyway. Uh, let's see. Wait. Default. Okay, yeah. Keyboard and mouse. Because it just seems like I would probably want keyboard and mouse mode. Okay, let's play. Overkill skeletons to prevent them from rising again. Sounds about right. Freaking skeletons. I have never heard of this studio before. Hammond Games. The fallen city. Oh yeah. The land of no return. No return, Where baby. Darkness won. Darkness won. Demon hunters. One year ago, a plea yeah. for help summoned hunters to Zagaravia. That's where I come in. And this no freaking weirdo. No one returned. I went schniggy schnack on a giant spider. Raven delivered his message. And a goat man. Too me I thought he him. lived on Pea Mountain. He saw what I seek. Adrian's yeah. Afraid. Beep, beep. One of the precious few I have. And the only man who knows about oh. the past. This guy has a ring setting for a head. Just plop a gemstone in there. Anyway. Whatever haunts this cursed city, I will face to find my friend. Oh yeah. I will find my friend. And then we will kiss with tongues. Okay. Ha ha! Okay, sweet. Alright, I'm already winning. And I already got things cool. Oh, I'm gonna loot this body. Healing potion. Wait, what? How do I loot this body? I want his loot. Please give it to me. Okay. The city is eerily quiet. Not a human soul in sight. Wait. What? Why you show me the inside, but I can't go inside? That Monsters seems. Have claimed the streets. Dim light shine through the dusty windows. Ooh, I got some gold I just for hitting what stuff. Hide behind them. Ah. <laughs> I sense something hidden. I something do too. Sinister than the monsters. Something faint, like a whisper in the back of my mind. Hey, you like whispering in my mind? 
Come on, baby. Pumpkin Pie Festival? Oh, I didn't know it was that kind of a game. Like, giant spiders right off the bat. You know what I'm saying? Like, RPGs. You gotta... You gotta giant spider it up, always. Like, when hasn't it been giant freaking spiders? What are these? Slimes? Head crabs? Newspapers? <laughs> I, I don't know what these are. <laughs> anyway... Anyway, okay. Yes, the spider hatchling. I don't need to. You know. Anyway, uh, by the way, um, yeah, isometric uh, RPG with really good camera and super tight controls. Okay, okay, I'm listening. I'm here. You got my attention. Oh, and I can rotate the camera. All right, all right, look at you. Hey, get the freak. Yeah, you, you afraid of me, because I, I am death in the night, suckers. Death in the night. Oh, get out of here. You can't come at me. Anyway, Whoop. yeah, I do like how it like, you know, does the cutaway thing on the buildings, um, even though it's like, but why can't I go in there? And maybe I will be able to in the daytime or something. I don't know. But uh, it just gets things out of the way of the camera, which is like, ugh, so needed so often. Yeah, take that pumpkins. Take that pumpkins. There was gold in the pumpkins? Like, actual gold and not just like, you know, golden pumpkin innards. Why is this making swirly woos? Anyway. Oh, I can jump. I do have jumps. Alright. Good to know. I'm just, like, looting and pillaging. I'm wrecking this town and I don't care who knows it. Who is that? You want to know what I'm doing? Wrecking this town. <laughs> Worse than the spiders ever did. Just swinging my sword indiscriminately. Yeah, I I dropped the hammer of indiscriminate justice. Like, what'd you think? Very, very satisfying sword swing. Oh, come on, dude. Come on, dude. Haha. -ha. Death awaits you all with nasty, big, and pointed teeth. Okay. Let's knock out this big old pile of shameful shambles. Shambles is what I call it. It's my trademarked word for shameful shambles. Anytime you get shambles that are shameful, Shambles, trademark, patent pending, all rights reserved. You may not use without the rig consent of Major League Baseball. Anyway, hey now. Hey now, don't dream it's over. You know what? They come, they come to build a wall between us. Can't let them win. It's freaking ridiculous. Wait. Why are there more of ye? Like, I thought that I cleared. Wait, where... Where are ye? Oh, you're like... Okay, I see, I see. Oh, wall jumping 
And it's not like, uh, I like a game that understands like how to make a mechanic, you know, reasonably easy to do. That's just, that's just good looking out. You know what I'm saying? I mean, come on, man. Hello? Who goes there? Hello? Can you hear me? Oh, I hear Voice you just head. fine. What else? If you can hear me, jump now. Good boy. Now roll over. <laughs> just kidding. Do I have a roll mechanic? I don't know. I haven't found out yet. Okay. Get get wrecked upon. Where Why are you Okay, so you spawned inside that building? That's ridiculous. Look, Hunter, a treasure chest <sighs> up there on the balcony. Come on, go get it. You can oh. use the exercise. How dare you? I am in the best shape of my life. And you're just a disembodied voice. Disembodied voices, by definition, not so great in the body department, you know what I'm saying? Okay, fine. I'll do it this way. Hata. I love these boxes. You never know what you're going to get. So exciting. Ooh, a shotgun. Wait. Hold up. Okay. All right. Plus 32, 1834, 20 to 40. So, slightly better with the shotgun. Do I... Oh, it's just got a warm-up time. I just wondered if it... Um, I just wondered if it had a... An ammo count. But it doesn't. It just looks like it has... Okay. Oh, and I've got, like, I didn't notice, but I've got power moves. Ah, ha, 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 ha. You know, mana stuff. Okay. Yeah, I believe this would be the entrance of Castle Ziggurudskis. Anyway, I'm a ziggurat. Why would I not... Checkpoint activated. If you die, you'll be able to return here. Yeah, I will be. Oh, get wrecked upon, bat. Ha ha! <laughs> Ranged combat against the gigantic spiders. As God in Tended. Wait, what, what, why, why am I not going around and sneaking around this way? Haha. -ha. Have at thee, you dinguses. Oh. So it was probably meant to go this way. But the, uh... <laughs> the spiders seem to sense it. They seem to know. Look at them gathering. This, this is pretty cool. Like, yeah, let's go into the Fallen Keep. Wait, where the freak am I? Okay, shut tight. An alternative route to great, but it looks a bit... Something passed before me. The place reeks of death. I'm beginning to doubt that there are any survivors here. Okay. Yeah, me too. I have my doubts, man. Survivors, not bloody likely. 
I know this place. You're Me too. Getting closer. Come on, open that door. Or you... watch out, Hunter. Those dummies look tough. They outnumber <sighs> you. You should consider retreating. <laughs> Wait. Sweet. Look at those dummies with their red eyes and long noses. They're laughing at your feeble attacks. <laughs> Sweet. Wait. Are you still fighting the dummies? Come on, put your back into it. Hit harder. Like, really? Maybe I should stop wasting my time on you, Hunter, and make friends with the dummies instead. Yeah, make friends with the dummies, you dummy. Wait, do it. I didn't take damage. Uh, oh, attack the dummies to build up overdrive. Okay. I'm attacking you, I'm attacking you, I'm building up my overdrive, boop do 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 let's get maximum overdrive. Okay. Yeah, this guy is especially susceptible to getting shot use a demon power come on waiting 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 come on here we go here we go here we go yo here we go yo oh a demon power where did you learn to do that hmm from anyway, your mom come Meet me in the next room. Oh, I I'm will. Trapped in that box. Come on, break it. You think I want to break your freaking box, man? That's ridiculous. Why? Why are you obsessed about box breaking? Destroy this table. Destroy this table. Break this table. Wait, that's not me. <sighs> oh well, I must be in another dungeon. <laughs> Okay, get out of there. Hold up. This is a time when it's probably best to freaking use... Yeah, you gotta overkill the skeletons. They weren't kidding. Okay, die, you son of the bench. Collect my reward. Oh my god. I'm testing my special powers. Find my way through the keep. Okay. Why why don't I? Oh, but I wanna get some ham hocks. Ain't nobody let a man have some ham hocks. Anyway. Ha ha. Now the fun thing is, is that I could be playing this as a point and clicker, a Diablo-esque point and clicker, but it's like, hey, do you want to keyboard and mouse it? Or do you want to controller it? Like, I honestly want to try different controller schemes and just see what I like. Yeah, take that armor. I haven't been shooting all of the armors and whatnots. But maybe I should have. Also, like... <sighs> 
I want to play a game sometime that takes pole arms seriously. Like, w when you know your history, you know that pole arms were very important. Perhaps much more important. Not just perhaps. <laughs> they were more important in military victories. Okay, I released the guards from the cruel fate of the undead. Took dap do do do. Survivors beyond the tall walls of the castle. Doubt it. I sense something shiny nearby. Let me give you a hint. It's bigger than a spider, but it is also full of treasure. And it is sitting on top, looking down at you. Yeah, I... Th Honestly, I think I enjoy the melee much more. Like, if I'm being honest. Wait, hold up. This one's 1735, 20 to 40. Okay. Alright. It's because I feel like in, like, uh, pick people off and sort of single them out much more easily with wait what the frick oh shotgun of the bear just sitting there waiting to be picked up shotgun of the bear 1530 yeah these are not amazing shotguns so I love that it's you know a world of swords and pole arms and s such nuts. You told me there'd be something shiny. And so far, the only shiny thing has been y your magic words magic man oh huzzah yes you found it good boy what did you get something shiny I did thank you oh my god that's so nice of you to think of my addiction to very shiny things oh jeez See? It's much easier in my book than, you know, trying to separate and pick them off. There's something about that voice. Okay, something hold up. Quite place. But this is the time for <laughs> equipping this mamma jamma. Many monsters in my line of work. The ones that talk Wait, come on. are always the worst. There you go. All right. Did it. Okay. And then we'll equip this again. Good times, good times. All right. We're progressing. We're making good time. We're doing things. It's good. Castle Zagor is the only remaining beacon of hope in this godforsaken city. There are survivors here, tough, grim, and desperate. Wonder for how long I can use this place as my base of operations before the forces of darkness sniff the living souls hidden behind its thick walls. I don't know. A while. Hunter's outfit, Cavalier's outfit, Vigilantes. Uh, okay. Precision critical strikes. Uh, let's see. Strongest and direst. Okay. Interesting choices, huh? Um, I think I'm gonna go. Oh, and now I'm picking my mode. Let's just go normal. Uh, normal character. 
Yeah. There are survivors after all this time. Castle Zagora still stands, a refuge from the horrors outside. Anyway, sweet. All right, I, I want to talk to everyone. I'm Damien the Alchemist. Oh, hi, Damien. Like you do bombs. make potions and bombs and whatnot. <laughs> We alchemists are said to transmute gold into air, but it's all for the benefits of science. Hey, take a look through my inventory. There's not much demand from hunters these days. Yeah, probably not. Let's take a look what you got. Uh, yeah, I don't have enough gold for any of these things. Oh my goodness. But but you do have some some good stuff there, my friend. Like Oh, transmutation. Okay, okay. Like, remember how I freaking love torchlight? Yeah. I think th Oh great. Another hunter comes Another hunter to comes to save the day. Countless hordes now. Or maybe you'll just die like all the others. I probably will. My name is Victor Vran, and I didn't expect this kind of warm welcome in Zagaravia. I'm looking for a friend. I won't stay a minute longer after I find him. Listen, Vran. I don't care. Just one rule. Don't promise the impossible to Her Majesty. Every day I endeavor to convince her to give up hope of saving this city. And with you around, she will become even more determined to stay and die in this cursed Oh castle. my god. Like, why? Happens, I will hold you personally responsible. Why are you, why, why are you hating on me so much? I'm a, I just want to hit you with a sword now. Oh, you're going to sell me scrolls and Praise mages? Praise heavens. God has answered our prayers in this hour of need and sent you here. Oh man, you are certainly full of it. It is what you are full of. Oh my god, why can't I have the chestesses of treasures and gold? This is. Oh, I'm. <laughs> this, this queen immediately looks Welcome like someone to that. Zagaravia, hunter. Thank you for answering our summons and bringing your sword to our cause. Soon we will push back the enemy. If you hurry, you will be rewarded. Uh, okay. Your Majesty, I would. My, my goodness, you. you're pretty. Do you like bad boys with hats low over their eyes? It is not safety that we want. We are going to win this war and free my kingdom from the demons. Oh, I bet you will. No further help is coming, Your Majesty. What brought me here is the fate of a fellow hunter by the name of Adrian. Ooh, so I'm gay for a guy named Adrian. That's cool. You may believe no help is coming and have given up, but we stand strong. But if it is your friend you seek, you must go south to the Royal Gardens. Thank you, Your Majesty. Thank you. Stay pretty, the queen sweet cheeks. Is strong -willed. It must be how she got this far, but it changes nothing. The city is overrun. Yeah. City is overrun. You're not wrong. But, like... Anyway. Oh, it, go it goes on and on for a bit. Anyway, cool, 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 cool. Well, let me just hit this with my sword and get all of its treasures. Okay, let me just hit this with my sword and get all of its treasures. Okay, let me just <laughs> hit this guy with my sword and get all of his treasures. Anyway, well, ladies and gentlemen, I, I think that, that I'm ready to stick a pin in it in terms of me, you know, experiencing this game a little bit and getting a sense for what it has to offer. Uh, cool stuff. Very, very cool stuff. 
enjoying it is is good. Where's my yeah exit to main menu? Yeah, reset all monsters and ongoing map challenges. All right, it's okay. I don't have any map challenges and monsters being what they are. Anyway, ooh, I can buy a Highlander outfit. It's got some DLCs and whatnots. Uh, but yeah, it is a whole thing. Anyway, let me put a score on it. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, okay. Uh, so, obviously, Victor Vran is a deep game, big old world to explore, lots of places to go, lots of things to do. Clearly, clearly, that is the case. Um, and I'm sure that I could sink hours upon hours upon hours into this game, uh, and it looks like I would have just a dandy of a time doing it. Uh, very cool. Love me a good isometric action RPG. And uh, yeah, this one, it, it is just very well done. Uh, good art style, good voice acting, good, uh, you know, it, honestly, uh, camera. Like making it so the camera can see what you need to see. Good choices. Like just a lot of good choices being made in this game. So, yeah, I I like what I've seen, and I like what I've played, and I think it's really great, and obviously there's a lot more to it, but, you know, it, it's not like when there's a lot more to it, because <laughs> it's one of those things, sometimes people get on me, they're like, no, oh, well, you barely play a game, and it's like, yeah, but if I don't enjoy the game's core mechanics that I learn in the first few minutes... How am I going to enjoy the entire rest of the game? And so, like, this is a game where I could tell, you know, it's going to get increasingly frantic. You know, I, I was just looking at some of the achievements because I did not get any of them yet. And there's things where it's like, kill 20 enemies with one single hit. And it's like, yeah, I'm going to have to level up for that. Like, <laughs> I'm going to have to power up considerably. Um, but also it means that I need to be facing 20 enemies at once, which means that, you know, it's going to get frantic. Uh, so I haven't seen it on completely frantic mode. That's totally fine. But anyway, there's a lot of game options. There's a lot of things you could do. Um, I like how they do the character build. It's very, you know, straightforward. Um, cause you know, looks like the game is just built around like, hey, just get in there and start swinging away. Like, you know, worry about everything else secondarily, but uh, yeah, just get in there and start swinging quick as you can. So, uh, good stuff. I, I like it. I, I like everything about it. So here's my final score uh, for Victor Vran. Four out of a possible five Ray Harryhausens. Now, if you don't know your Ray Harryhausen, uh, this dude, genius stop motion animator. Uh, you see him here with one of the children of uh, children of the dragon's teeth from the original Clash of the Titans. Um, and man, like <laughs> my buddy and I swear, one day we were watching Clash of the Titans and this scene where like the children of the dragon's teeth. Like, uh, they're basically, it's an army that's like planted in the dirt and they just arise and they're like, come on, fool, have at thee. Um, and so, yeah, dude thinks he's got the, the thing all well in one. And then, you know, crazy lady plants an entire army of skeletal warriors. Anyway, the funny thing is that these dudes, and if you've never seen it, you really owe it to yourself. Just watch the whole movie. It's really good. But there's a part where, like, they start off, they're, like, creeping slowly. Boom, 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 boom. And then they all just bum rush the, the place. Like, it goes nuts, and it's hilarious. Like, it's it's so funny to watch. But you know when you're watching it, you're like, oh, my God. Some dude spent literally forever. And it's funny because you can get like detailed close ups of these models. Like this dude did not mess around. So, yeah, Ray Harryhausen, 
that's high praise. You know, I I just I uh, thinking about the skeletons, and that got me to thinking about you know the scene, Clash of the Titans. Anyway, so yeah, good things all around. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I need to go to bed. So that's gonna be it for this one, and I will see you in the next one. Okay, bye.